the last few days, a dip in the sea might just be the thing actually to refresh what. It's a little bit cooler today though in the west, the east still very hot and humid for all parts of the UK. More sunshine though on the way this afternoon. A slight change though from yesterday is that we had a weather front pushing its way into the west overnight. That's what's brought cooler air into the west and is making for a day today rather more of sunny spells than wall-to-wall -wall sunshine. Still ahead of it though some very hot and humid air across eastern parts of the UK. For this afternoon though for the southwest of England and Wales still plenty of warm sunshine to come. Temperatures down a couple of degrees on yesterday but, but actually probably quite preferable to some of the intense heat we've had recently. Similar story too for Northern Ireland and for Scotland. Yesterday we had 28 degrees in the highlands of Scotland, aiming for 22 or 23 here today and just somewhat freshened by a south or southwesterly breeze. Plenty of warm sunshine for Northern England this afternoon too. Temperatures along the North Sea coast recovering nicely now after a couple of chilly days here thanks to mist and sea fog. For the hottest of the weather though, Yorkshire, Lincolnshire, East Anglia and the South East the place to be this afternoon and I think for East Anglia and Lincolnshire we could see that heat sparking some heavy and thunder showers as the afternoon wears on. Nothing though in comparison to the plume of heavy and sundry rain that's set to get into the southwest of England and Wales this evening, spread to Northern Ireland and Scotland overnight tonight. Some torrential downpours likely here for a while and it's going to be a muggy and humid night. 20 degrees, the overnight low tonight in London. So a warm start tomorrow and a grey and wet one for many parts of the UK. This feature here on the pressure chart, the one that's going to push that heavy rain northwards overnight tonight and slowly push it further north as we go on into Monday on its tail, bringing in plenty of hefty and thundery showers. Cooler weather coming into the west, maybe some brighter spells later on in the day. Scotland drying up, northern England, the Midlands, East Anglia and potentially the southeast. Some heavy torrential thundery downpours are likely as temperatures here could push up to 31 degrees Celsius. Certainly much, much fresher as we head towards western areas of the UK. After tomorrow's rain, though, actually the story for most of us for the remainder of the week is going to be a dry and warm one yet again. For Tuesday, we say goodbye to our weather front and we pull in some clearer and sunnier air. Temperatures coming down just slightly in the east, so some fresher weather arriving here. A weak weather front sitting towards the northwest. So expect some cloud around on Tuesday for Scotland and Northern Ireland. Sunny spells at best, maybe a little bit of cloud lingering back from Monday too across southeastern areas of the UK, but for most, more spells of warm sunshine. Just a shade cooler, as I said, in the east than it has been recently. Similar temperatures too on Wednesday, the mid-20s for most. The high teens, though, once again, for Scotland and Northern Ireland, a fine day all in all pretty grey towards the north of the UK. More cloud around here too on Thursday. It looks like we will see the arrival of some patchy rainfall, but this is a warm front bringing in this rain. So as that continues to push its way northwards for Friday, what it will do is drag in some warmer air. So temperatures going up towards the end of the week. Looks like there's plenty more sunshine on the way in the next few days. Back to you, John.